Pokemon Go, drawing thousands of users in less than a week. But as 23 ABC's Jessica Harrington explains for us, why the Bakersfield Police Department is warning users to always pay attention to their surroundings while they play the game. Jessica? Yeah, Jackie, across the park, there are hundreds playing this new game. It's similar to a scavenger hunt. It uses your cell phone's GPS to make little Pokemons appear all around you. And the goal is to catch them all. Today, men, women, and children were all around the park playing the game, but officials warn users to not get too wrapped up in it. Caltrans sending out this tweet today saying, catching your favorites on Pokemon Go is hard work, but please don't engage in distracted driving to do so. Snorlax will definitely wait. And players say they've already seen how Pokemon Go can distract people. It, it gets dangerous out here because some people are actually playing and they're actually too into it and you have to tell them to move out of the way or go around them. In other parts of the country, there have been reports of people committing crimes against Pokemon Go players while they were alone. But Bakersfield Police and the Kern County Sheriff say that's not an issue here. BPD warns users to be careful when walking and playing so that they don't walk into a roadway and reminds users not to trespass on private property while playing. And while it's perfectly fine for players to be out at the park right now, BPD does remind users that the parks close at 10 p.m. and you can be cited if you're caught here after those hours. So I guess you will just have to wait until 5 a.m. tomorrow to catch them all. Live in Southwest Bakersfield, Jessica Harrington, 23 ABC.